Hey guys, welcome back into Mountain Dog Companion. Thanks for tuning in again. Hanging out with Lori and Simba's puppies. These are the girls here with me. We'll do the boys in the next um, half of the video. But um, so if you're wanting to just see the boys, skip to the end or to the middle of the video or around that. Um, but talking about these guys' personalities and a little bit about size. Um, this is kind of their play area right here. Um, we got some doggy beds, a nice little puppy, uh, puppy couch, a potty pad, um, some puppy pads and some nice interaction uh, stimulating toys that make noises and you'll probably hear it throughout the video they all like to play with it and interact with them and it's just um, a ton of fun for these little guys and girls so um, hanging out with everyone going through talking about each one we'll talk about Lassie first um, she is a little bit more on the energetic side she's a busybody. you can she, see she just wants to go play She's having a good time trying to chew on the mic, um, but a nice round, <laughs> nice round confirmation, nice round head. If she'll hold still for you there real quick. You're okay, girl. Yeah. Um, and a nice tuxedo up front, so more of a uh, circle up front there with the tuxedo. Nice white socks front and back and a little bit of weight on the tippy tail there for her. So she is a little bit more energetic, a little bit more driven um, and outgoing. So. Um, that is Lassie. She's down here just having a good time. Um, we'll move on to Lulu here, the small girl out of the group. She is a sweetheart and a kiddo's favorite. Um, she is just a lover, absolutely sweet. You got the perfect markings, got the socks front and back. A little bit of a Swiss kiss up top, which is a beautiful feature for her. And then um, some nice eyebrows there, along with a nice white tuxedo look. And she is middle of the road when it comes to personality. It's not like she's the most outgoing, but she's also not the most chilled out. She's a lover. She is a very, very special and sweet girl. I believe pick number three is planning on uh, moving forward with her. So super excited um, for her and uh, for what's to come with her. So super excited for that. Um, moving on to Miss Lady here. Uh, one of the bigger girls, a nice round head for her. Um, a little bit less white on her uh, socks. So you'll see uh, kind of the tippy toes covered with her and a nice, uh, very nice uh, socks here in the back along with that tan. What's up, girly? How are you? <laughs> Got Lassie just going ham down here. Um, but yeah, very nice confirmation. Not a big or not a large amount of weight on the hind or the, the tip of the tail. Um, so just overall a little bit less weight than some of the others in the litter. Beautiful cross up front um, and a stunning girl. I know she resembles a lot um, with Liberty as well. So they're very similar um, when it comes to personality and size and everything. If anything, ladies a little bit more energetic, um, a little bit more outgoing. So um, you'll definitely, <laughs> the guys rolling around here, uh, having a good time, but you'll definitely see that once we get to Liberty, which I think is hiding here underneath my legs here, just cuddling up, maybe not. She might be over, over here, I'm not sure. We'll get there. Um, but moving on uh, to Lucy, she's also one of the more energetic girls. Um, so her and Lassie are very similar um, and a really nice looking girl. She's middle of the road when it comes to size, not the biggest, not the smallest. Um, she does have a little bit more of a smaller confirmation or a smaller head, a little bit more so, and a little bit more petite overall, which um, if you're looking for something a little bit more on the smaller side um, or petite side, this might be it for you. She does come with a little bit of a higher drive and that beautiful pink nose, um, which will turn black. Um, in case you guys were wondering, um, their noses do end up typically turning black um, and tend to kind of fill in here in the next couple weeks and you'll kind of see it coming along. Um, Chris has got her camera on Miss Liberty here. Uh, she does, she's very similar to Lady, um, but just a little bit more relaxed, a little bit more laid, out, uh, laid back and chill. She is actually, uh, has been selected by pick number two. So congratulations. To sweet little Liberty. Um, she does have the nice white socks in the front and the back and she wants to go now. Normally she is very laid back and easygoing. 
um, but a beautiful girl. She kind of got that nice tuxedo up front um, and just beautiful confirmation. Um, like I said, she is more on the laid back side, if anything, um, but a very, very sweet and special girl as well. Okay, I might need to figure out. I think this is the one I need, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah. And that's who I have. I thought so, but I wasn't sure. Okay, so last but not least with the girls here, we got sweet Miss Lollipop. Um, she is a very middle of the road temperament, very middle of the road with pretty much everything when it comes to size, when it comes to markings. She doesn't have the most weight. She doesn't have the least amount of weight. She's not the most outgoing, but she's also not uh, the most laid back. So very medium with everything. Got the nice white socks front and back. Beautiful white blaze in between her eyes. A nice tan on her eyebrows as well. Nice little white tip tail too. And you can kind of see her. No Swiss kiss for her. Just overall a beautiful little girl. Um, so that's it for the girls. Okay, moving on to the boys here. We got starting off with Leo here. Um, he is actually probably the biggest boy. So starting off on the bigger end of things, um, these guys are all fired up. So you'll see them running around playing um, tug of war and everything back here. So. Um, they kind of got their spot back here at cement, so it's a little bit cooler. So they'll hang, uh, hang out on it. We do have a little thin puppy blanket on it, um, but they'll hang out here. It's just a touch cooler. So, but moving on with Leo here, he's got a little, little spot up top. It'll probably end up fading out. And then you got the nice socks front and back. What's up, big dude? What's going on? Hello. <laughs> and a beautiful white blaze. So um, stunning guy, probably the most laid back in the litter. A big cuddle bug and a very sweet, sweet personality. Very Velcro for him. Uh, moving on here, I believe we have Mr. Lex. I'm just going to check that out. If I may, I want to try and keep everyone's name straight, but it's a little bit of a challenge. No, this is Lucas. So Lucas was actually picked first in the litter. And he is also one of the bigger boys, um, kind of running alongside uh, Leo there when it comes to size. He's got a nice, uh, beautiful round head and nice stocky build. You can kind of see the, the cavity and everything's just uh, a little bit bigger and stockier. Um, so beautiful guy, nice white tip tail, nice white blaze. What's up, big dude? Mm-hmm. Yeah. And he was picked first, so congratulations. Um, the family actually came out and visited and picked him out personally. So um, very, very exciting and um, definitely a good time. So we do take visitors. If anyone wants to come out or uh, just wants to come out and visit and make their pick or just come out and, you know, maybe uh, see some puppies and see if it is the right fit for you. So moving on here is uh, Luigi and he is a little bit more on the energetic side, a little bit more outgoing. Um, he thinks my fingers are pretty tasty here, um, but I can assure you they're not. But nice white socks front and back, a little bit more like just the tippy toes covered in the front and a nice white tuxedo look. What are you looking at, Leo? Yeah, you're just sitting there checking me out. Nice tuxedo, nice white cross. Um, in the front and just an overall beautiful look for Mr. Luigi. Okay, so next up here is Loki. Um, he is, I just call him Mohawk Boy, <laughs> um, but he, his blaze kind of extends over top and gives him a unique look. Um, so his blaze starts off obviously down here and just kind of extends over top on the top of his head. Beautiful guy, nice round head beautiful stocky confirmation just an overall round look for him uh, one of the more laid back boys um, maybe a little bit more on the independent side not in a bad way but maybe just a touch uh, more independent and laid back so um, again that's loki you can see he's just a little bit more reserved a little bit more chill um, he'll hang out take it easy he just wants to take a nap okay guys moving on last but not least we have lex um, <laughs> guys, having a good time over here. Um, but a nice little dot up top and 
Um, there's two boys that kind of have a dot up top. You can see Leo here, the first one we talked about, um, has a little bit of a spot, and then uh, Lex here does as well. So a nice tuxedo up front, a little bit more weight than some of the others. I think he has most weight. Um, and just nice markings overall, beautiful, really what we're looking for. Nice white tip tail as well. And a little bit more on the relaxed side, maybe a little bit more, um, I'd say medium, he's not the most relaxed, but he's also not the most outgoing, uh, just kind of middle of the road, uh, leaning towards that relaxed cuddle bug side. So, uh, but beautiful puppies here all in all, everyone seems to be doing very well health wise. Um, and their personalities are absolutely phenomenal. Exactly what we were hoping for. They're just very, very sweet. So if you guys have any questions about this litter or any of our litters coming up, feel free to reach out to me. My name is Jay Miller here at Mountain Dog Companion. If you're loving the content here on the YouTube channel, feel free to um, give us a thumbs up and subscribe to the um, profile here and we'd love to have you back in future videos and future content. So if you guys have any questions, feel free to reach out to me. But in the meantime, I hope you have a great rest of your day and we'll see you guys next time.